And welcome in, everybody. Glad you're with us. Two of the best teams in the game square off. It's the Seattle Mariners and the Detroit Tigers. And now. All right, we'll be back to get this Detroit one started after this. Tigers. Just about to get started. And on the mound in this one, Jay Mack. Singing the numbers he's racked up in his career are almost unprecedented. True legend in this game with over 300 career wins. Always a joy to watch him go to work. It's effortless out there. Doesn't wear his emotions on his sleeve. Doesn't know when he's high or when he's low. All right, ready to get underway. Now the left fielder, Mark Littleton. The pitch. Swing and a miss. And we are underway. First pitch, 708. The pitch. Swings and misses. And it's 0 and 2. Come on, guys. Rolled over to third. Me handles. Gets it to first. It. One up, one down. Batting second. The center fielder, number three. And now we check out the Mariners lineup. Down to the eighth spot, a guy that's trying to get back on track at the plate, Tim Hale. Yeah, Boog, he just hasn't been himself at all lately. I mean, it's hard to know if it's mechanical, if it's mental. It's just a struggle all the way around. It's something that everybody goes through. Hey, I think the now. key is you've got to stick to the process. You've got to focus on every pitch and don't worry about the result. Take it one pitch at a time, one at bat at a time. He swings and fouls one off. No score, just hey, getting started, here. top of the first. Owen oh, 2 as he waves at that one. Oh, two. two really good back-to-back -back sliders, now in an 0-2 count. He's feeling real confident about finishing this hitter off. He can go anywhere he wants. Swings through that, and it's a strikeout. Two quick outs at the top of the first here tonight. Well, they got him swinging that with the knuckleball there, and right I feel field. this guy's pain, hey. Boog. I just have nightmares no, about the times that I had to face Tim Wakefield. Not good numbers, and if my career was based off of that, I would have hey, been in AAA. Dave Newsom up next for the Mariners. Ah. In there, and it's 0-1. The pitch. This to third. Over to first. And that will end the inning. Mariners go down quietly there. The Tigers coming up. No score. It's Major League Baseball on the show. All set for the start of the inning. And stepping in for the Mariners, Rick Leading Lucero. The, Mariners, the first baseman. Rick. Lucero. Hey, no outs now, none. And a pitch. And first offering is fouled off. The pitch. Ball that one. just misses. And that is ball one. Joe McDonald, our umpire behind the dish. Yeah, Boog, Joey Mack, sometimes a little tough to figure out. We may see some hitters and pitchers asking him where a pitch was here or there, but most of the time he keeps it reasonable. Strike two. One what about an umpire's strike. height? How much of a role does that play in your experience and what the strike zone is like? Yeah, I think it pushes the strike zone hey, up a little right bit, here. which, you know, as a former hitter, you like that. You wanted the ball up. You didn't want to have to deal with stuff down in the zone consistently. And one away. 
Well, definitely a borderline pitch right there, and he didn't look too convinced as he headed That's back to the it. dugout. The you know, those are tough ones to let go oh. as a hitter, but with the human what? umpire calling balls and strikes, it's always going to be on you to protect yourself with two strikes. Rod Black hey, get ahead, up next ahead. for the Mariners. Yeah. First pitch, and that's in for a strike. We got one here. They say you win. Oh, two with the count. The wind of the pitch. Ball. Off the mark there. One, One and two to count. Two strike. Got it. And there are two outs. Off to a strong start, Singy, as he's punched out three of the first five he's faced. Well, he's definitely minimizing contact. He can get the swing and miss when he needs it, but he'll also keep the defense fresh behind him, allowing some balls in play as well. Two outs, base is empty. Hey, now we've got Martin two. Velasquez getting ready to hit. And he swings All and misses one. at the initial offering. The wind of the pitch. Hey. Look out. Oh, two. And a swing and a miss, and that's that. Mariners are down in order. They're down one nothing. Back at Comerica Park, top half of the third inning at the play. Alberto Marte, the designated hitter. Alberto Marte. And the right hater back to work. Strike one. And we got no outs. Left hand hitter waits. And a foul ball. And a pitch. Swing and a miss. Struck him out. Leadoff man retired here in the third. Boop, for me, that knuckleball was just devastating. I mean, you see it so well, you think you're going to go out there and get four knocks, and you just swing and miss. And I tell you what, I tried my best to put Tim Wakefield in the Hall of Fame. So we'll see. If he gets there, you know it's because of me. Tim Hale stands in now and lets that one go for a strike. And a pitch. And fouled off. Hey, get him with your best stuff right here. The 0 2. And a foul ball. He stays alive. The why to kick the pitch. Stays alive. Well, he hasn't gotten the result yet, but it's got to feel pretty confident. Three foul balls in a row. He's right on this guy. Left-hand batter waits. And a swing and a miss. Down on strikes. Now two out. <laughs> well, obviously the knuckleball. It's not a pitch designed to blow that by hitters, not. but you'll the see this ball. every once in a while. Oh, you give up on that Garrett. pitch at the plate, and then... The last moment it darts back into the strike zone and you're just not ready to get a swing off in time. Looks like it's 100 miles per hour. And I tell you what, I know from personal experience, it's not a good feeling. Now, Alex Harris. Hey. That one's in there, 0-1. And, There's a strike. Two down here. Line drive. Base hit. So the two out knock extends the inning and sends them back to the top of the order. 
Really nice job of two strike hitting in that at bat. Nice job of driving that pitch the other way on a line. You know, hitters, they take so many reps in the cages working on going to the opposite field, and it doesn't always translate into the game, but right there it did, and he did it perfectly. Next offering is downstairs. The rest of the lineup could learn a thing or two from this at bat right here. He's been patient, and now he's in the driver's seat with a 2-0 count. Two down now. Next offering is in for a strike. Man, 91 on the slider right there. That's a hard one. That's a low-end fastball for some guys. That one fouled off. Starting to get some pretty good timing on that breaking ball, but he's going to have to stay ready for a fastball. Don't want to watch one he's go going, right by going. you. Here's the pitch. Runner goes. And a foul ball. He stays alive. Comes a 2-2. Swing and a miss, and that is that. Mariners leave one. Still behind by a count of one to nothing. Welcome back. New inning getting started. And now for Seattle, Johan Rojas. The center fielder, number 33. Well, after putting up a nice Johan. inning on offense, got Rojas. some runs across, this is where you look for the starter to go out there, have a shutdown inning. Don't give yeah, that right, other team go, any now. hope. Uh, you just hope that he can get through this inning, get the bats back up there while they're hot. And here it comes. First pitch oh, swinging. These guys have been very aggressive early in the count, but when you're down, might want to be a little more patient. Take some pitches. See if you can extend those at bats and get some base runners on. To the right side. And he picks it up and he'll put it in his pocket. Here's the 0-2. Fought off foul. The wind and the pitch. Right side. What a play in right field. And there's one away. Now batting. Right fielder. Dave. Newsom. And up next for Seattle, Dave Newsom. Go ahead, stay ahead now. Hey, one away. One away. And that's in there for strike one. It looks like the weather could actually play a factor in this one. It's coming down pretty good. Yeah, it is, and it's not too bad yet, but the field's not going to be able to hold up if the rain gets nope. any worse than this. So keep an eye on the pitcher's mound as well and the rest of the infield start to puddle up a little bit. Swings through that one for strike two. And, two. and the right-hander deals. Swing, and this one's bounced on the ground. In plenty of time to first. Two quick outs here in the top of the fourth. The first baseman, number two, Rick Lucero. And now it's going to be Rick Lucero. Yeah, Caught ahead, looking now. his first time up. Hey, we got two down now. Check swing, but he went too far, and it's 0-1. Here comes a pinch. Swing and a miss, struck him out. Third out, and that ends the frame. Nobody left for Seattle. They trail it here, three nothing. We go to the top of the fifth, and stepping in for the Mariners, Rod Black. The Mariners, 
the second base. No outs here. Raw. What? Plays it one here. And he deals. Aye. That's in there. That's strike one. Kicks and fires. Swing and a miss. Oh, And that deflects off his glove. Tosses to first, one up, one down. Well, on the mound, very efficient, able now to produce an outcome, it seems like, within the third or fourth Vasquez. pitch of just about every at bat. Vasquez. Martin Velasquez up next for the Mariners. Kind of a throwback. No batting gloves. In there, and it's 0-1. If I'm one at the here. dish right now, I am aggressive over the heart of the plate. This guy's been filling up the strike zone, so you know you're going to get a good pitch to hit. And as nasty as his stuff is, you might as well take all three swings. One down, base is empty. Swing and a miss. One, One and two. two. Clearly he was sitting on a fastball right there and just ended up out in front of the slider. Hey, you can't fault him for his commitment. Now he's just going to have to battle with two strikes. Swing and a miss. Struck him out. And he's down on strikes now for the second time the today. Alberto Marte. In now is the Mariners DH. Alberto Marte. In there for strike one. We haven't seen a break in the weather, and the umpires might be forced to make a decision soon. Yeah, I think so, Boog. I mean, everyone looking and wondering when they're going to stop play. It definitely feels close. To first, oh. out number three. And one, two, three, go to Mariners. They trail in this one, three, nothing. Right Back Come here on, in Detroit, top of the sixth inning. And now the catcher comes up to him. Tim Hale. Leading off for the Mariners. The catcher. No outs here. Tim Hale. Mac back to work. And first offering is fouled off. When a guy's throwing a lot of first pitch strikes as a hitter, you got to be ready to hit. Now, that's not going to help you get deep into his pitch count and into the bullpen, but you got to take what he's offering that day. Kicks and deals. Strike two. Boom, that hook's looking pretty sharp today. Just a solid pitching performance so far, and I really think it's because of that curveball. Righty to the plate. Stays alive. out there so he's gotten deep into this game and at least so far not showing a ton of signs of fatigue the Allen Harris and now for Seattle Alex Harris one for one with a single so far him right here that Aye. one's in there on one Right-hander kicks, deals. And that one fouled off. And the 2 Cut on and miss. Struck him out. Back-to-back -back strikeouts. 
Oh, there's a three-pitch strikeout. He can do whatever he wants with the baseball right now. Mark Littleton up next for the Mariners. Yeah, and he swings and misses, and it's nothing in one. Two outs. And a foul ball. Swings through that one. It's a strikeout. That's his second strikeout. So another good inning for him on the mound. Six shutout innings now. 8-9-1 scheduled in the bottom of the sixth. It's the Tigers three. There's nothing. And welcome back. We go to the top of the seventh. And now the center fielder, right Johan Rojas. The center fielder, number 33. Johan Rojas. The pitch. There's a strike. And nobody out now. Righty delivers. And that one fouled off. Going to now. And down on strikes. And the leadoff hitter set down to open the seventh. Man, that thing just barely got the zone, so you almost can't blame the guy for laying off. I mean, with the way knuckleballs dart all over the place, realistically, that could have just as easily missed by four or five inches. It's such a tough pitch to not overcommit to, so sometimes you just hold up and hope it dances out of the zone. And now Dave Newsom. First pitch, and that's in for a strike. Hey, plays at one now. In there at the knees for a strike. Next pitch is popped up. Mine, mine, mine. Hauls it in, and there's two away. Boy, that was a hanging breaking ball right the there. I think he tried to do two. a little bit too much. Rick. Sometimes those eyes can get Ooh, really zero. big. I think his swing broke down as well, and that's what caused him to pop it up. Two outs, base is empty. Rick Lucero now at the plate. They say it went. All one's the count. Hey, come on now. Here we go. And he's down 0-2 as he swings through it. Tonight, his slider has been really impressive. I mean, tight spin. Seems like the hitters aren't picking it up out of the hand. Hey, we got two. Two down. Two down, nobody on. This one chopped on the ground, but foul. Swing and a miss, and he is down on strikes for the third straight at bat. Mariners go down quietly there. They're down 4 0. Seventh hitting stretch. Back here at the ballpark. Now it's going to be Rod Black. Here we go now. Let's go. The second baseman. The pitch. Black. And that's through there for a strike. The pitch and a foul ball. Deal two and down on strikes he goes and now one away. 
Wow, short work to send him packing to start the inning and no messing around either. All three pitches were in the strike zone, attack mode all the way, and that's pretty impressive given the pop he was dealing with at the plate. Digging in, Martin Velasquez, who's 0 for 2 with a pair of strikeouts. And that's in there for strike one. And a swing and a miss there. Just an outstanding job of spinning the baseball, moving it around, doing what he does. Got him. Two down. Well, they've had a great plan of attack for him tonight. I mean, finding all the holes in his swing and his approach, just frustrating for him up there. You strike out a guy three times in a game, I think that guy's got to go back and really study some video with his hitting coach, figure out how they're beating him, make this adjustment really quick, because word will get around the league in a hurry. Now, here is Alberto Marte. Hey, seven straight strikes to start the frame. He's got a chance at an immaculate inning. And the righty deals. Strike two. All right, there's number eight, one away. The wind of the pitch. That's a ball. Got close to the immaculate inning, and he just couldn't find the zone right there. When you think about it, nine straight strikes, so tough to do. And that'll do it. Mariners are down in order. Steep hill to climb. It's a 9-0 deficit. Now. Here we go. Welcome back. We go to the ninth, and here's the catcher, Tim Hale. Leading off for Seattle. the pitch. The catcher. Tim. And first offering Hale. is fouled off. Got no one out now. And the pitch. And it's fouled away. Next offering is fouled back. Pitcher having a pretty tough time getting that swing and miss. Third foul ball in a row. Swing and a miss. Struck him out. One away. <laughs> well. Obviously, the knuckleball, it's not a pitch designed to blow by hitters, but you'll see this every once in a while. You give up on that pitch at the plate, and then the last moment it darts back into the strike zone, and you're just not ready to get a swing off in time. Looks like it's 100 miles per hour, and I tell you what, I know from personal experience, it's not a good feeling. Harris stands in here, takes ball one low. Left-hand hitter waits. Foul back our way, and that's out of play. And a pitch. Oh, and that deflects off his glove. No play. That's an infield single. Multi-hit game for him now, and with the lack of results he's been having lately, I'm sure he's feeling some relief. That pretty much split the zone down the middle, and those are the ones where you got to make them pay. Littleton in the box now. No balls in a strike. You'll one. On the ground, could be two. Off balance feed, there's one. Back to first, double play. And that's the ball game. Terrific job in this game. He scattered two hits and pretty dominant. Efficient with his pitch count. Got himself all the way to the finish line and finished where he started. 9 nothing. your final in this one. For Chris Singleton and our entire crew here at MLB The Show, thanks for stopping by. I'm John Chomby. Talk to you soon.